this remaining fear. This remaining fear. Dr. Rosanna Massey is using the Emotional Freedom Technique, or EFT, on Rose Delgado. What EFT does is stimulate these subtle energies within the body, the ancient Chinese called them meridians. By manually stimulating them with your fingertips, it's emotional acupuncture. We don't use needles, we use manual stimulation. Okay. Tapping into the meridians or pressure points in the body, EFT helps people let go of negative experiences and emotions and be at peace. This remaining fear. This remaining fear. Dr. Massey is the only advanced certified EFT practitioner in New Mexico and West Texas. Within six minutes, she helps Rose get over her fear of the camera and deal with a past issue. I'm, okay. I'm doing great. I'm not, I'm not feeling uncomfortable at all. But sometimes we have all these issues carrying around with ourselves and that blocks us from advancing. Dr. Massey, who's been an EFT Second. practitioner for six Second. years, has treated All thousands right. of patients, and she says EFT can help people deal with a number of issues. Anything from angers to guilt, exaggerated grief, um, performance empowerment, self-esteem issues, um, phobias, Dr. Massey says emotional problems and trauma affect the physical body, and she says EFT can help with that as well. I had a, I had a back pain, and she would help me with that. And my back pain went away right then and there. Dr. Massey says EFT has many advantages over medication. There are no negative side effects, and the, and the effects are, you know, they last forever. It's easy. And you don't have to believe in it, you don't have to have faith in it, like so many other stuff that's out there. I gave EFT a try. My issue was I was very tired and at the same time stressed out. By the time Dr. Massey finished her technique, I was wide awake and relaxed. <laughs> I'm so relaxed right now. That's awesome. <laughs> I like, it's like I took a chill pill or something. Right. Dr. Massey says she's excited to bring this emotional healing practice to the borderland. It's a new paradigm and shift in the way of you think about health care could save some people a lot of money and some people a lot of time getting down to the core of their issues.